Machine repeat here, folks. Big thank you to Ross Shepard with Stanky Tractor Sales in Eaton, Ohio, for sending us that uh, cell phone video of the Alice Chalmers 8550 selling yesterday on the Eaton, Ohio auction, uh, which was actually the first annual Stanky Tractor Sales uh, consignment auction. It went very well, strong pricing, and again, 24000 on that Alice 8550. That's the second highest auction price I've ever seen on an Alice Chalmers 8550. Here's a look at the highest prices. Uh, now I haven't seen a ton of these 8550s, um, but ironically the all-time record price was set this summer, late this summer, August 4th, 2020, in Franklin or Frankfurt, Indiana. Our friends at Sullivan Auctioneers had a sale. You can see the 79 model, 5,342 hours, went for 33,000 bucks. Now that, that one had a very interesting story on it also. Uh, had been displayed at the 1979 Farm Progress Show. And here's a picture of that 8550 that sold for 33,000 bucks. Beautiful 8550, again, 33,000 bucks on auction this August. And if we could zoom in on that sign there on the cab, but it actually says Big Orange, and again was displayed at the 1979 Farm Progress Show. Now, again, this tractor and the 8550 sold yesterday for 24,000 in Eaton, Ohio. Good examples of how these kind of, I'll call them vintage, but 1960s, 70s, early 80s four-wheel drive tractors that you don't see that many of out there. The, the value on the nice ones has really gone up. Um, Sullivan Auctioneers, who sold this one for 33000 in August, of course, sold those uh, rare international four-wheel drive tractors a couple years ago. Uh, well, actually, they sold the 7588. There are only two made. Uh, I think it brought 151,000 bucks, just amazing. And I think within that year prior, there had been record prices on the International 7388 and the 7788 up in Manitoba on an auction. And if you follow Mecham's auction, of course, they've set records on the John Deere 8020. Uh, we recently had a record set, I think Polk Auction had the sale, uh, for a John Deere WA14 or a Wagner. Four-wheel drive, Amon Auction has sold some really high four-wheel drive tractors. So again, these four-wheel drives from the 60s, 70s, early 80s, uh, if they're nice, prices are pretty strong. Your next piece of equipment is on MachineRepeat.com. Search equipment from dealerships across the country to find what you're looking for. Only on MachineRepeat.com.